What's going on stackers? So in this video I want to talk a little bit about the number one budget friendly graphics site for low content book publishing newbies. So welcome back to Stacking Profit. My name's Paddy and over here we give you the tools and resources to learn, grow and master passive income streams so that you can live a life of freedom. Now, I want to talk a little bit, you probably guessed already, about Creative Fabrica because I believe this is one of the best sites out there for everything related to low content book publishing. Now, if you stick around to the end of the video, what Creative Fabrica has actually gone and done is set us up with our own discount code and a pretty good one at that. So if you're interested, stick around to the end of the video or you can click that link down below. Now, first of all, I want to talk a little bit about Creative Fabrica and why this is such a great site for newbies. So, why is it such a great site, especially for newbies? Well, you can get absolutely everything on this website. We can get fonts. Now, fonts are only good if you have your own. No, that's wrong. Fonts are only good if you pay for Canva Pro. Because within Canva Pro, let's go over to my Canva Pro for a second. Within here, you have the option option no that came out wrong you have the option to upload your own fonts so over here on creative fabrica they have thousands of fonts so if we go over to here click on browse all this is going to pull up some of the fonts that they have but we can see they have really really great ones we can see popular this week so these are all the popular fonts this week we can actually go through if we click here on view all 50,000 fonts 50,000, that's absolutely crazy. Then from here, we can actually sort by popularity or by latest. So let's just click on the latest. Now from here, we can actually see all these really, really great fonts. And quite a lot of these are going to work really, really well on books for us, publishers. So the, with this one, look at this, Boom Fanta. Bit of a weird name, but it looks really good. So this would work really, really well with a kid's book. So I could go in here, download this, go over to my Canva Pro, because that's what I pay for. Here, I have the option to upload that font. So if we look through all of these fonts that I've uploaded, there's a couple of duplicates, but that is going to happen because I download so many fonts, but we can see just so, so many. And this is one of the reasons why I also love Canva Pro. Now, if you want a Canva Pro 30-day free trial, there will be a link for this down below as well. Now, let's get right down to the bottom. There we go. We can see how many fonts I've got in here, and it's an absolute beast of amount. So from here, I can actually upload more fonts. So I can come over to Canva, no, Creative Fabrica, find all the fonts that I like, upload them, and then start creating my books. But my point is that there's just so many graphics and fonts here within the site. So we have the option to look through all of these fonts. We have the options to look through all of the graphics. Look, coloring book for kids, coloring books for adults. We have illustrations, backgrounds, and also interiors. So right here, KDP interiors. So not only we can get the fonts from here, we can get the graphics from here, and we can get some interiors. Now with the interiors, I do highly recommend kind of modifying them slightly so you're not using exactly the same as everybody else, but that's just my personal preference. But from here, look, 6,500 results just for interiors, which is absolutely crazy. When they first added this section, I remember that there was only about 500. So to grow that fast, that quick is pretty amazing. Please note though, anything that you get from Creative Fabrica, please do your own due diligence and make sure that the creator or the seller is actually allowed to sell that because I am starting to see more and more graphics being sold on here that really, really should not be being sold. So keep that in mind as well. So we can get our fonts from here, we can get our interiors, and we can get our graphics. So let's just click on, let's go here, 
let's just go to browse all. Sometimes I like to do that as well, just so I can get an idea of what's being uploaded to the site. From here, look, we can see all these pretty good graphics. Now, if we wanted to niche down, we could start doing dog clip art. Say we wanted to create a funny, unique dog notebook or something like that. And we needed some graphics for the front cover. Now, if I do that, we can see all of these. Now, one thing I do want to note as well, this is really user friendly and really, really beginner friendly as well. Now, when you are first starting out, I do not recommend going and buying memberships or tools or anything like that. Start the ball rolling just by using free tools. You can do that, it's pretty easy. That's how I started. But then once you start creating an income and have those royalties coming in, start investing that money into better tools. This way, you're not actually going out of pocket to buy these tools. Now with Creative Fabrica, you can go in and download these or purchase them individually. But what I recommend doing is actually paying for the membership. Remember, only if you have royalties coming in. Don't go and purchase a membership if you can't afford it, because then you're just going to council and then with their terms and services, anything that you've downloaded, you can't actually create new books with. It's a bit weird, but I'm going to cover that as well in a minute. But you get the idea. Now, you're probably thinking that I actually recommend Creative Fabrica a lot. Heck, this is what this video is about, me recommending Creative Fabrica. But it's only because I use this pretty much every single day in my own low and no content book publishing business. So I only really recommend products or services that I use myself and I feel comfortable with actually recommending as well. Yes, I might make a small affiliate commission, but I really, really like Creative Fabrica. Now to prove this, let's actually go over to my account and go to my downloads. So let's just give that a second to load up. From here, we can see everything that I've downloaded. Recently, it's been a lot of Easter stuff because I've been creating Easter books, a few Easter notebooks, Easter coloring books, and things like that. So you're going to see a lot of Easter stuff here. But if we go down to the bottom, we can see I have 60 pages of downloads and there's 20 products to a page. So how many is that? Let's actually just get out the calculator and see how much I've earned not earned, sorry, <laughs> and see how much I've downloaded. So let's just get that calculator. There we go. So we got 20, because there's 20 pages times, not 20 pages, there's 20 products per page, and there's 60 pages. So 20 times 60 equals 1,200. So here on Creative Fabrica, I've downloaded over, well, around 1,200 products, which is absolutely insane. But my point of this was to show you that I use Creative Fabrica every single day. It's a must-have tool for me because I can get all my graphics, my fonts, and sometimes the interiors as well. So I can get absolutely everything that I need. Now, if I were to purchase all of these items individually, that would have cost me a hell of a lot, but I pay for a membership and the membership allows me to come in and download anything that I need at any time. Now, like I said, near the beginning of the video, Creative Fabrica has set us up with our own discount. There will be a link down below if you want to come through and check it out. This is going to be lasting probably around a couple of months, I think until June or somewhere around then, and then this discount will be not available anymore. But from here, we can see they've set us up with a 30% off on all access subscription. Now, in fact, let me just go over to an incognito mode while I've got this open as well, because I just want to cover a couple of bits. So let's go back to here. We have 30% off on all access subscription. So instead of $29.99 or $29, it's now just $20.30. I don't understand that 30 cents part, but hey ho, that's out of my control. This is what they've set us up with. This is just for us, the Stacking Profit community. So you can get unlimited accent 
access, sorry, for just $20.30. That's 30% off. We can go in and download anything that we need at any time. And then this is valid forever. So if you get in at this price just for $20 per month, that's all you're ever going to pay. And you can cancel at any time. Now, what does the all access actually get you? So I can show you on here, but in fact, I'm just going to go over to here and let's go to subscription. So we can see it here in an incognito mode because I am logged in in the other browser. This just makes things a little bit simpler. So let's get rid of that. Let's scroll down. So the normal access is $29 a month. So with our special link, you can get that down to $20. But this is what's included. Everything from the craft subscription, 50,000 fonts, which is just absolutely insane. 1.8 million, yep, that's 1.8 million graphic assets, 27,000 cut files, I don't use them, or them, but we also get that commercial license. So for $20, that's what you get with the discount code or discount link down below. Be sure to go through and check it out. And now there's one more thing that I do want to cover really quick because this is what a lot of people struggle with. So frequently asked questions just here. Can you use the files commercially? Yes, you are allowed to use the fonts and designs in commercial projects. This license is valid worldwide. You can make an unlimited amount of sales with the full POD license. So that's one thing I just wanted to cover, but this is the main bit, these two just here. So what happens when you end your subscription? So once you end your subscription, you will lose access to download new files and updates and you are no longer covered under the full POD license. This means that you need to stop selling the designs you downloaded with full POD. Don't use POD licensing. What that essentially means is just taking a graphic, plugging it on a book, a t-shirt with no modifications at all. That is what I don't recommend do. So that's only applicable when you do that. If you take your graphics and actually design designs like we're supposed to, this is what happens then. And take these products off your POD stores, blah, blah, blah. The exception is when you used a file to create a complete new design as then it will fall under basic POD, which applies to all products, which is explained in the licensing just here. So again, I always recommend to go through and read the licensing, but what this essentially means, if there's a graphic that's got a POD license and you want to use that and you use as is with no modifications, if you cancel your subscription, you've got to stop selling that product. But if you're using the graphics, which don't have the POD license, just your standard commercial license, if you're using those graphics and then create actual designs and then cancel your subscription, you can't use any graphics that you downloaded to create any new designs when you don't have the subscription, but you can go on to keep selling your previous designs. Remember, only if you have actually designed and not used as is. Now, is there a limit of downloads with my subscription? No, there are no monthly download limits with the subscription plans. Everything included in your subscription plan can be accessed immediately. So there's no download limit. I pay for my membership, which allows me to go in, download fonts, graphics, anything that I need over and over again, as many times as I want. And that's why I pay for my membership. Now, like I said, if you do want to sign up and get a membership, always go through and read their licensing on any website that you use. Creative Fabrica makes their licensing really, really easy to understand. And if you have any questions, you can easily just send them a support email and they do reply and get back to you. So that's pretty good as well. Now let's just go back over to here because there's one more thing that I just want to talk about really quick, and that is the freebie section. So over here on Creative Fabrica, they have a freebie section where you can get all freebies, which include fonts, SVGs, graphics, and embroidery. So this changes pretty much on a daily basis, but everything you see here is completely free, and you can find some really, really great stuff. So if you haven't got an account, 
go through, sign up just for a free one, just so you can check this part of the site every other day. Because again, you can find some really, really great stuff. And if you want to check out that deal that Creative Fabrica has set up for us for only $20 or $20.30 per month, then click that link down in the description below. So that's it for this video. It's gone on quite a while, 15 minutes. But I've talked about everything that I wanted to talk about. I still believe that Creative Fabrica by far is the number one graphic site for KDP, for content, no, for low content book publishing. Because again, we can get absolutely everything that we need here for our books. So again, click that link down below if you want to go and check it out. Now, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Also, go hit subscribe and hit that little bell icon so you can be notified for any further videos. That being said, I've been Paddy, this has been Stacking Profit, and I'll see you again soon.